A Mother for Choco by Kizo Kaza. Choco was a little bird who lived all alone. He wished he had a mother. But who could his mother be? One day, he set off to find her. Find one? To find her mother, yep. She, he, she really do have one? Let's see. First, Choco met Miss Giraffe. Oh, Miss Giraffe, he cried. You are yellow just like me. Are you my mother? I'm sorry, sighed Miss Giraffe, but I don't have wings like you. Next, Choco met Miss Penguin. Oh, Mrs. Penguin, he cried, you have wings just like me. Are you my mother? I'm sorry, sighed Miss Penguin, but I don't have big round cheeks like you. Then Choco met Mrs. Walrus. Oh, Mrs. Walrus, he cried, you have big round cheeks just like me. Are you my mother? Now look, grumped Miss Walrus. I don't have striped feet like you, so don't bother me. What is he, man? Because the little bird is asking a question, and he thinks that question is silly. No matter what, no matter where, Choco searched. He couldn't find a mother who looked just like him. Aw, he's sad. He didn't ask for a bunny? I think the bunny is a baby itself. And what's that? A camel. I don't know it's a camel. It's an animal that lives in dry, like, in the desert. When Choco saw Mrs. Bear picking apples, he knew she couldn't be his mother. Mrs. Bear didn't look like him at all. Choco was sad. He started to cry. Mommy, Mommy, I need a mommy. Mrs. Bear came running to see what was the matter. As she listened to Choco's story, she sighed. Oh dear, if you had a mommy, what would she do? Get some food. Oh, I'm sure she would hold me, sobbed Choco. Like this? asked Miss Bear. And she held Choco very tight. Yes, and I'm sure she would kiss me, said Choco. Like this, asked Mrs. Bear, and she lifted Choco and gave him a big kiss. Yes, and I'm sure she would sing and dance with me to cheer me up, said Choco. Like this, asked Miss Bear. And she sang and danced together. When they stopped to rest, Mrs. Bear turned to Choco and said, Choco, maybe I could be your mother. You? Choco cried. But you aren't yellow. And you don't have wings or big round cheeks or striped feet like me. My goodness, said Mrs. Bear. That would make me look very funny. Choco thought it was funny too. Well, 
said Mrs. Bear. My other children were waiting for me at home. Why don't you join us for apple pie, Choco? Apple pie sounded wonderful to Choco. So off they went. When they arrived, Mrs. Bear's other children rushed out to greet her. Choco, said Mrs. Bear, meet Hippie, Allie, and Piggy. I am their mother too. The sweet smell of apple pie and the sound of laughter soon filled Mrs. Bear's home. I think that they are other little kids who lost a mommy. Really? Mm -hmm. See, there's a pig, a hippo, and an alligator. Well, we just saw the hippo. Or did we? We seen another hippo. We didn't see that hippo. Oh. That's a, that's a child. After their delicious treat, Mrs. Bear gave all her children a big warm bear hug. And Choco was very happy that his new mommy looked just the way she did. The end.